straw polls are in. And our ratings are way up. I mean, off the charts. Julia has done us the solidest solid. After the trees, she grew food for the starving peasants. She fixed the dry wells. She even helped this one guy's bajanked case of head lice. I mean, children of Earth are back on top. Her flealessness suggests that your time as High King has been so brief the Felorian people don't yet know what you stand for. I stand for them! I stand for economic stability, for a solid, well-researched strategy. That's it. I'm going to tell them in detail my plan. Rafe, write this down. My fellow Felorians, I hereby set forth my policy to restore economic and societal growth to a reunified Fillory. Blah, 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 blah. So uninspiring. Does he really think he can win by boring them to death? Josh! I hereby declare all native Felorians shall receive 10 free sacks of grain every year. And how exactly are we supposed to grow that much grain even with magic? You're making a promise you can't keep. Bambi, first rule of politics on Earth. All you have to do is say it. It doesn't have to be true. I hereby declare under my administration low interest loans for all new infrastructure. Easy, no interest loans. And we're going to build Fillory's first power plants. Like geraniums? Will Tick's granular policies keep you warm at night? No. You know what will? Extending the Felorian summer. My proposition for growth in new sectors. Free healthcare for all. Based on rigorous survey research. Champagne fountains in every village. The abatement of dependency on the Golden Goose standard. Wealth! Regulation of agricultural waste to prevent environmental runoff. Feasts. Annual famine. And rampant poverty. Boat parties! 